News Release Friday, February 10, 2023 New Disease could provide insights into how the cell's recycling system contributes to a healthy brain. Researchers at the National Institutes of Health have discovered a new neurological condition characterized by issues with motor coordination and speech. They report their findings in NPJ Genomic Medicine. Scientists from National Institute of Health's National Human Genome Research Institute and HGRI and Undiagnosed Diseases Program UDP identified three children with the condition, two siblings and an unrelated child. The three children all had issues with motor coordination and speech, and one child had abnormalities in the cerebellum, the part of the brain involved in complex movement among other functions. Additionally, the children all had mutations in both copies of the AG4D gene. AG4D aids in the cellular housekeeping process called autophagy, which cells use to break down and recycle damaged proteins and other defective pieces of the cell to stay healthy. Autophagy is a fundamental process used by cells throughout the body, but neurons are particularly dependent on autophagy for survival. However, little is known about how a G4D contributes to healthy neurons. The first inclination of a G4D's effects on brain health came from a 2015 study in which researchers identified a genetic neurological disease among Libetto Romagnolo dogs, an Italian breed known for their fluffy coats and truffle hunting abilities. The affected dogs had abnormal behavior, atrophy of the cerebellum, issues with motor coordination and eye movement, and at G4D mutations. While this 2015 study invigorated research interest in a G4D's role in the brain, scientists had yet to connect a G4D to any neurological disease in humans. Among genetic diseases, we've solved many of the lower hanging fruits, said May Christine Malikton, MD, PhD, and H.G., R.I. staff scientist and senior author of the study. Now, we're reaching for the higher fruits, genes like at G4D, that are more difficult to analyze, and we have the genomic and cellular tools to do so. Computational analyzes predicted that the three children at G4D mutations would produce dysfunctional proteins. However, Three other genes in the human genome serve very similar roles to a G4D, and in some cells, these other genes may compensate for a loss of a G4D. While all cells in the body share the same genome, some genes are more important for certain cells. When the researchers studied the children's at G4D mutations in skin cells, the variants did not affect the cell's recycling process, but this may not be true in the brain. The brain is so complex, and neurons have very specialized functions. To fit those functions, different neurons use different genes, so changes in redundant genes can have major impacts in the brain, said Malikton. To simulate cells that rely more heavily on a G4D, the researchers deleted the similar genes in cells grown in the laboratory, and then inserted the children's at G4D mutations. The researchers determined the cells with the children's at G4D mutations could not carry out the necessary steps for autophagy, indicating that the children's symptoms are likely caused by insufficient cellular recycling. Still, much about at G4D remains unknown. We have only a bird's eye view of many important cellular processes like autophagy, said Malikton. A rare disease that involves changes in one gene can help tease apart how that gene acts in a broadly important cellular process. Other components of autophagy are involved in common neurological disorders, such as Alzheimer's disease. Knowledge of this rare neurological disorder could lead to new avenues of research about at G4D's involvement in more common conditions. That's the million-dollar question in rare disease research, said Malikton.
rare diseases can help us understand biological pathways so we can better understand how those pathways contribute to other rare and common conditions. National Institute of Health researchers and clinicians continue to work with the children in this study, and the researchers are aiming to identify more patients. Treatments are many steps away, but by learning more about AG4D and autophagy, researchers may be able to develop new treatments for this condition and others involving autophagy pathways. N. H. G. RI is one of the 27 institutes and centers at the National Institutes of Health. The NHGRI Extramural Research Program supports grants for research and training and career development at sites nationwide. Additional information about NHGRI can be found at https www.genome.gov. About the National Institutes of Health, National Institute of Health, National Institute of Health, the nation's medical research agency, includes 27 institutes and centers and is a component of the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services. National Institute of Health is the primary federal agency conducting and supporting basic, clinical, and translational medical research and is investigating the causes, treatments, and cures for both common and rare diseases. For more information about National Institute of Health and its programs, visit www.nagov. National Institute of Health Turning Discovery into Health Registered. Morimoto M. Bampani V. Gazaz N. et al. Biallelic at G4D variants are associated with a neurodevelopmental disorder characterized by speech and motor impairment, NTJ genum, that 842023, https slash slash doi org slash 10.1038 slash s41525 minus 22 minus 343 minus 8.